I am Sandeep, working as a QA analyst at a company called Clarity and the company size is you know, 50 to 100 employees and uh, I would like to rate Zira service management as 5 out of 5. So we are using Zira for our effort tracking or dash, you know, listing our dashboard activities or day-to-day -day QA activities. So it's kind of a management tool, test management tool and we have a lot of integrations within Zira. It could be the documentation or integrating with the automation tools. So, so basically on our day-to-day, -day, we will be using it for effort tracking and more transparency. Zira provides a lot of capabilities such as you know creating tasks and linking the tasks to the stories and epics and also um, effort tracking or resource assignment is very easy and also the way the dashboard is designed it is easy to understand and track the progress of each and every task and stories and also in addition to its core capabilities it also provides various integrations we can offer so let's say for example uh, related to the QA automation or using any third party tools even if you would like to filter out the list of tasks based on the release or based on the sprint you can integrate it with the you know excel or even you can integrate with reporting tools and also any QA automation tools where we can you know keep track of the automation and also it supports some of the other integrations like confluence where you can have the documentation and um, github as well and also slack or ms teams any kind of these communication as well so it makes this um, our job easier so i am personally interested to see more visual analytics in any of the management tools so obviously zira has its own uh, visualization to some extent you can create reports and customize it and you can view the uh, visual representation of the progress and all but i feel there could be an enhancement on how um, you know more easier analytics so that actually that actually give us a glimpse of where we are at and in terms of you know um, if there is a way to filter it with the at the sprint level or at the release level or based on the tags so if we have more visual representation i think it will be more uh, um, more helpful right now i am not uh, you know liking the existing uh, visual analytics